The problem with those kinds of cancers is that they're really tough to treat because if you imagine like a tumor with really thick stromal tissue, it's kind of hard to penetrate. Today's but students are different from students 30 years ago or 25 years ago. They're, they learn in different ways and so we're constantly in Gene Society exploring new ways to train our students. Previously we all sat in lectures for you know hour after hour after hour. Now they can hear their, they can sit in the lectures, they can hear their lectures online, they can do six different things while they're listening to the lecture, they can listen to the lectures at 2x speed on their computer. And you know lecture is probably about half the time in the first years and then small group is the other half of the time with your afternoons mostly free except when you have clinical skills um, which is very hands-on and fun but you, you know the small group work is it's very interactive it's case-based it is just a great variety and kept you keeps you kind of intellectually engaged throughout the day increase the computerized learning tools that are now available increase uh, simulations um, emphasizing patient safety and, and cross-cutting themes like professionalism uh, across the uh, four years. We want to make sure that prospective students understand that we recognize that they're different from students 25 and 30 years ago, even if they don't know what those differences are. We know what they are and that we're willing to change to adapt what we teach and how we teach to the people that we teach.